Hello everyone! Welcome to Farming Sim 17. I guess we are in patch 1.4. Uh, I don't know if we'll notice. There didn't seem to be anything huge in the patch notes. Um, a lot of it is just vague, like fixed issues. Fixed issues. So I haven't really had any issues, so I think we'll be fine. Uh, for some reason, this harvester didn't harvest all this, so let's start that. And then we have uh, to go collect some canola so we can feed our pigs. I can't remember. Yeah, we gave them some. Oh, so we have no hurry. We don't have to go early. We can basically just wait until we have finished harvesting and then make a big old pile of canola. Um, a lot of people are confused about why I'm making large piles of food for the pigs. Uh, I could just store it nearby or I could just run up food like I've been doing. Um, I guess the main explanation is that I just want to try something new I think is probably the biggest. It's kind of like the uh, when we were selling silage. I used extender outers on my own playthrough. We used a tipper for one part of it, and then we used a leveler for another part of it. So all three do the same thing, like you're selling silage. But there are three very different ways to do so. It's just nice to try new things. So I thought, uh, let's make four big piles and see if the dropper offers would work. Didn't seem to work as well as I thought, so now we're just going to use the this guy. Uh, but I think we still will, will get four big piles. If I end up not liking it, then once the four piles are gone, we don't have to continue using it. So just kind of wanted to test it out. So anyway, we can take... Well, okay, we'll take this back to the biogas plant. Are you kidding me? I don't want this. Okay, so we'll take this back to the biogas plant. That should be fine. We'll back this up. Uh, someone in the comments said that they might be adding hot pink. Not sure if that was a joke, uh, but if that is true, that's very exciting because we can change this purplish color to actually like a pink color. And then this truck will look perfect. Uh, looks like our harvester is done here, so we'll get it back on track over uh, in, in where we kind of started. Wonderful. Hit the old H key. And worker Willie's gonna finish this field for us. Let's go back to our lizard pickup. Take a brief shortcut here since we have a sweet truck that can do so. See, it does tricks and everything. It's a great truck. And we'll just drop this off. I don't want it in the way, really. I think this will be out of the way enough. And there we go. And now, since this thing is uh, speedy, we can go back. Let's do a jump. Uh, we just made like a million bucks from stunt jump. Look at that money go up. Uh, and then we can grab this guy and take him back to our farm. I don't remember why we had him. I think it was for seeds or something. Either way, we just need to clean up a little bit. Whoop. Hey, whoop. Yeah, there we go. So yeah, 1.4 doesn't seem too different, but for some reason you need it for the uh, new DLC which is coming out. I really haven't looked into it that much, uh, but I think it comes out on Valentine's Day, which would be next Tuesday. So I will probably have some sort of video up 
um, once I am able to access and have time to make one. I think it's just equipment. I'm not really sure uh, what equipment. Uh, it's the, the Kuhn brand. Uh, I'm not sure what we have from them already, but if we find the K's... There. So right now we just have um, like one thing of each. I thought there was also the mowers, but I guess here's that straw thing. I thought the mo. So yeah, I don't know. They're just gonna add more of that brand. They do brand packs. I I don't know. I don't get into them too much. I'll usually buy them because they're usually not too expensive. I didn't buy in 2015 the or farming sim 15. I bought them all. Except the very last one, and I don't remember what the last one was. I feel like it had something. I think it had something to do with beets, or potatoes, or something. Hey, hey, did you, did everyone see that? Maybe it's because I wasn't driving, but it didn't like pause my game when that uh, great demand came up. However, it did bring the map up, which is really annoying. I don't need the map. I know where it is, even though I actually don't. Uh, see, look at that. Great demand, still less than the mill, so we don't worry about that. Look at the bean prices right now. Wait. Wait, these bean prices are out of this world. Did the patch, like, increase prices or something? I feel like all these are a lot higher than... Hmm. I should read the patch notes again. I feel like all these are a lot higher than they were. Like, I remember getting up to 2,000 was difficult, and now the red is 2,100. Right? Because 28 is crazy. Huh. I wish we would have waited for patch 1.4. I might also just be remembering wrong. Um, yeah, I'll have to go reread those notes. I don't remember seeing anything in there about price increases or anything, but I, I might have just missed it. Anyway, let's empty this to make sure he can finish. Whoa, is he like full? Is that really good timing? No, I think I just stopped him. Alright, we can probably go... dump this off at the old pig pig lot and then we just need a pile of corn which we have planted we just need it to grow it might be grown I can't actually tell from this render distance all right I think 14,000 will make a nice pretty pile of canola probably too much but oh well we uh we live a life of excess so we'll be fine all right this time we'll actually feed them before we dump it Saves us a little time. Shouldn't be much. And then we'll go over here and dump it next to our wheat. Beautiful. Oh, I just kind of like how it looks, too. Just like these heaping piles of food. Then we have our big old bucket there to shovel it in. Wonderful. Okay, let's go finish the field. We have 17 canolas in here. Can we find them? Does anyone see the canolas? It's like that line from the movie, don't forget the canola. And then he grabs like this big old yellow flower from the back seat. Pretty good movie. All right, Willie is not quite finished. Let's go see if our corn's done, and then we can skip over to the morning. Yes, corn is good to go. All right, let's get to morning. Just for video's sake, and beautiful, we can see again. We will run around this tree. Ooh, thirteen and a half thousand from milk. 
What do our animals need? We probably need to stay on top of that. Look at that, 2,800? Wow. Hmm. That has to be different. Oh, wow. Okay, we have a lot of yellow here. Uh, we could go around with straw. We need some hay. We could just do a water, a water run. I think that would be good. We have our pickup truck. We just have to go pick up our water tank. Excuse me. This is a really weird, like, view. It's really throwing me off. 7,200 from property income. Look at that money. We were just rolling it in thanks to our greenhouses. Might be time to buy... Oh, I don't want to go through that field. I don't know who, who the farmer is, but they would not have been pleased. Might be time to buy two greenhouses once I uh, get the... Once I get these animals watered. Oh, yeah. I, mm, mm. This isn't the best. Helper E has completed their task. I wish you could give the helpers names. So instead of seeing Helper E, it'd be like Helper Jim. Or Helper Henry. Or Worker Willie, you know? That'd be fun. But nope, it's just Helper A, Helper B. Alright. Let's fill this guy up. We do have a water tank down by our cows. We just don't have a vehicle down there, which is not ideal. We can always take a uh, tractor down there with a tipper and get some manure. We might just go on a manure run and then while we're down there we can hit up the uh, water tank. Or we can always just buy a cheap... what is it? How much is it for this cheap... yeah we could just buy a cheap uh, pickup and literally just leave it for water. It's kind of an expensive investment but no We'll probably have some sort of, like, uh, what do you call it, telehandler down there at some point, and those have things that can pick up water. So we'll just wait on that. Yeah, we really need corn stuff. Cultivators, sowers, bigger, bigger, bigger corn stuff, as I always say. Here, pigs. Enjoy the water. There it is, filling up. All right. Do we water sheep? I can't. Yeah. Also, it has been just. It is. It's just. I have no words to express how great it's been. Not dealing with cleanliness. I will. I will 100% say that was the right decision to make. To just download the table manners mod and just be done with it. I, I've kind of. I mean. Woo! No, sometimes I don't drive realistically, by the way. Um, sometimes I do, but when there's like a lot to do, I like to just get it done. Um, anyway, kind of from the beginning, I non-secretly hated the uh, cleanliness mechanic, and it's really great that we can just get rid of it and not deal with it, because it's it's nothing I want to interact with. If, if it is something you interact with in your game and you enjoy that, more power to you. I just kind of can't stand it. We have two, almost three pallets, about three, two and a half pallets. Okay, I'll drive a little realistically for you guys. Sorry, I, I've kind of been jumping all over the place today. I try not to do it too much. This is This kind of puts you in a bind though, because there's no great way out of here. Um, you'd have to go, yeah, there should be like a path that connects here, but we'll make our own. Okay, we'll drive through here, a little path extending out towards this road. Beautiful, not a lot of traffic today. Okay, I think it's time to buy two more greenhouses. No, I don't know if I can... Gosh, we have $62,000. It might be time to buy a bigger cultivator. I love buying new equipment. 
And we really need to plant more corn. And it also, it'd also be nice just to plant more corn for chaff. Like, I think it'd be kind of fun to do another run. Because um, remember, it'll take multiple episodes to grow that much and then rent the forager and actually do it. But I really want to try the silage fork because I think it'd go really fast just doing a silage fork. I mean, 10,000 a load and not deal with belts just, just to give it a shot. We'll see. That's like down the road. Come on. There we go. Perfect. And we'll just drop it off here. We don't really need this. We'll just park this next to our manure stall. Alright, so we should have a long time ago started our corn harvesting, but I just sort of got really busy with watering. Um, so we need to actually... Okay, come on. Pipe out. Pipe out, sir. We need to empty our canola. These things are slow. After driving that pickup, this thing is so slow. Alright, we're gonna stop it here and we'll drive this to him. We can also get our um, white pickup or white tractor and start cultivating this for more corn. Or more soybeans, now that they're worth like $9,000 a pop. Might be worth doing that again. Alright, let's check on cultivators. Or should we check on sowers? Probably sowers. Or slurries. Because if we do slurry, we get free um, free fertilizer. Might be worth investing, because I wanted this one. But it might make more sense to get the... Oh my gosh, this is literally twice. But it's also twice as much. Yeah, we might have to get the Zune Hammer. Um, because again, that cultivator we have, it can hook up to this. So it might be worth getting this for a little bit. Because we'd also want to invest in these. And we can if we really wanted. I don't feel really good about this yet. We could just change our slurry to just take it automatically. Like workers will just take the digest it. Which is what we'll use first. Because we actually can't sell this at all. It can only be used for fertilizer. Uh, that's to digest a tank, biogas something probably. I don't know. But I don't feel good about that yet. Maybe after we after we use slurry for a while I'll turn that on. But right now we'll, out, we'll do it all ourselves of course. Um, because that's, I think it, it'd be fun. So we might, we might do that first, because that'll save us a lot of money in fertilizer while we keep planting fields, since we have a lot of it now. Uh, we have a lot of digested, and then we have, oh, uh, 88,000, what, 90,000 um, liquid manure. So it might be worth doing that. Okay, I think that will be a day. So yeah, next time we'll start harvesting our corn, and we'll probably look at getting slurry and start slurry on this field and get kind of start getting rid of our uh, solid fertilizer dependency dependency i think that's what i meant okay yeah thank you for watching hope you're still enjoying this uh, 40 whatever episodes in have yourselves a very nice day